Okay, let's go ahead and look at how to create a PayPal Buy Now button. So we're in your account. Come over here to Merchant Services. Once the page loads up, you choose Buy Now Buttons. You can see it asks you what type of button that you want. We'll just stick with the Buy Now. You put in here the name of it and an ID price. You can customize your button. I don't play with any of that stuff because it's not really necessary for what we're doing. Come up here to step number two. And it says, do you want to save it? Yes, you can track it. We're not going to worry about any of that. And we're going to come to step number three. Do you want your customers to change quantity orders? I said no. Can your customers add special instructions and a message to you? Look, you can say yes. I mean, really, we're doing a simple download product here, so um, there's not much that they need to tell us other than, hey, thanks, we've received your product. We don't need um, the postal address. And the thing that we do need to complete here is these two guys here take customers to this URL when they cancel the checkout. So say for instance they cancel on the way, you can pop in there a URL. Don't forget to go ahead and do it first because if you don't put that in there correctly, your ticket and you leave it blank, it'll give you an error. And the last thing that you need to do is this guy here, tell them where to go after they have bought your product. And then we'll scroll down a little bit further here. And the last thing we want to do is click on our save button, or sorry, our create button. And you'll see now that it will pop through to another window and it's giving us some information here. It says, you are viewing your button. You can click select code, copy, control C and paste. So you can either click on select code here and it will select it all. And then you can go over and you can paste it and you get this particular image here. Um, for some of you, you will be using your own image. And if that's the case, you can click on this email one and then you select this code. And then what you do is once you've gone over to your image and you've got it inserted into your website, you simply right click on it and you link it and you link it with this address here so that when they click on your image, your shopping cart image, it then fires up PayPal and the shopping goes through or the buy button goes through rather than using this image. So I hope you enjoyed this video and good luck with your selling online. I look forward to seeing you again soon.